Okay, cool. Well, I just want to know how it played how it played out. Um, first climb. Guess who it took? I took Fucking off. Yeah. Sandy and I were rolling uh, all day, just swapping off. He had a flat. I kept on trucking, and I entered the dirt alone. Uh, Sandy flatted. I, meanwhile, <laughs> I think probably had a group of six or seven, kind of myself and Lawrence and Ryan and a couple other guys, and we just kind of rolled over the top and all through the valley and yeah, hit the dirt. I think we got a time check about five minutes back or so. So I was just like <laughs> cruising and I was solo all day. And then at the top of the climb, we started this long, wet, gnarly, slippery downhill. And I was like, all right, just don't flat. That's the only goal. And I think like what, within you know 60 seconds, literally 1K to go, um, all of a sudden Sandy comes by. I'm like, crap, the mountain biker caught me. And I kind of sit on his wheel. I'm like, all right, I'm just gonna wax him in the sprint. And then, yeah, I Mr. Mean, mountain Biker really comes by. Wasn't sure how like nasty it was gonna be because we'd seen your stories and stuff, but it was definitely a bit soupy, but like pretty nervous heading into like some of these big puddles and stuff, but nothing was too deep out there and kind of rode with my group, kind of get a feel for the dirt and then uh, just kind of got to the front and went, kind of ate everything I had before I hit the dirt and then just went full sand and I really didn't think there was much of a chance. I kind of asked the guys at the top of low gap how far it was and they said three minutes and I was like, oh well, I'm just gonna, you know, So you two it. literally didn't see him come? You saw no, 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 either of them. I didn't, I didn't think like, I was like, oh, I'm almost to the pavement, I can't see anyone. No, I'm just like shredding and then I just like caught a glimpse of them and could see Sandy on the front and Peter and still on the pavement. I didn't know if I was gonna be able to get him and like, could tell I was like don't look back don't look back we started playing a bit of chicken we started back. playing chicken don't look back. and then and all of a sudden Jeff was whoosh but yeah like I, I let out a few expletives and yeah. ha maybe half a mile to go <laughs> I just like got as much gear as I could and just slingshot it and just yeah. held off to the finish so. so pretty surprising on a course like today that it would come down a little bit of pavement and the chance to have a sprint right I, I wouldn't yeah. have expected uh, that yeah, yeah there's no no funner way to win a race than on the downhill. Proper so. hopper out there, man. Well, congrats. Thanks for coming. I was working on a proper man. hopper. It was a proper Sweet. hopper. <laughs> Full Tomac finish. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> yeah, that was a proper hopper. Proper. That's you know, what I was thinking when I was, when I was like, it wasn't flat. horrible, well, but I was like, this is pretty I, fucking hard. That's what I told you at the start. Yeah. I was like, I'm, I set my bike up for the last ascent. And that's, oh, you did. Yeah, that's what thinking. I was, okay, I'm just gonna. Like, I'm just gonna have some fun and let so, the sand in it. How many psi did you have? 27. In my 40 C's. 45. <laughs> 27 the whole day. And yeah. 45 for me. <laughs> Literally like twice. <laughs> Peter, See, I picked up on a little got, something here. I got Jeff's. a few tricks and still. It's hard to go low. Like you know you can, but to really commit well, to he's it. He's got it's hard. the skills to handle low. I'll just pinch it. <laughs> yeah. So. Something you got to remember, he said he pulled the full Tomac, and if you get him, you know in, if you get him in the same manner, <laughs> but if you get him in the same manner, then you have to say the full kabush. Yeah, kabushed you. Kabushed well, you. kids these days don't even know who Tomac is. They know who Eli is. I don't know the move you're talking about, but I know who John Tomac he'd, is. He'd win win races on the downhill uh, okay. with dropper bars. Even, well, he'd also win a downhill race the next day when the cross country race. Yeah, well, I know. Yeah, he was badass like that. Oh, Pushed. and I gotta get home to watch the Supercross tonight. See if Eli can take another one. All right. Well, take Sandy should be Sandy back. Thanks.